but uh, there was no reason, to answer your question succinctly, there was no reason to drop the bombs on those two cities in Japan. Hirosh- y- Yaki- I think it was like Hiroshima and Yagasaki. Okay? No reason for it. Well, just like our military's done a lot of things for no, lot of problems, um, for no good reason. You know, we have a lot of wonderful people, different, and different food. Mm-hmm. You start to go around a lot of things. Yeah. How nice they treat you, and then some are busy, some are not busy. Yeah. But um, I hope it never goes on like that again. Well, I mean, we have 20 military bases surrounding I- Iran, so, I mean, and really... I don't see Iran as what people say they are because we've kind of laid off them now. Is that Iran because we, we were there with the uh, other Arabs. 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 That seems to straighten out because we're, we're medically inclined. But, uh, it seems like... Uh, I guess it's, it's settling the way it's supposed to, but uh, with all that's going on, it's kind of setting in my mind more. Yeah. But, you know, we're losing the last people. Yeah. And, you know, it's coming to like too much of a common word that we can't say that we're losing these people. Okay. And let me ask you something. You know, do you think do you think the majors and the generals really care about the people who are under them? Or do you think uh, they're just a piece of meat? Let, let me, even sergeants. Yeah, I think, I think they do, uh, but they don't want to lose their man at, at the same time. Um, uh, they do pretty good. Um, the thing is that, was, uh, you know, I'm starting out my new, new family, but it, it was the same fact that knew me. Uh-huh. And, um, everybody is. You know, and yeah, they do care for all their works and all their, you know. So we'll see because I have to sit down. I might have to take a tranquilizer because yeah, because um, it's been going on and uh, the, let the me changes, let me... the changes are really here. You know, they, they really happen. Uh huh. You know, changes. So I'm gonna be thankful because I got to eat. Can I, can I ask you some? Do you suffer from anything like PTSD or anything like that? No. No kind of syndromes from war or any no, any trauma? Beans that this is a holiday. It's not a free <clears throat> holiday. But not a free holiday, a working holiday. Yeah. Then it seems like everything is, is what's going on and then now. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to go over here and uh, take a tranquilizer. Well, may I uh, suggest something to you? It don't seem like too many people around here uh, care about the gospel of Christ. Yeah, I do too. I do. You do. Yes. You b- say you're That's a believer. In, me. You say you're a believer in Christ. Jesus okay. Christ. Okay, great. And then I have to exercise it more. What do more. you What do you believe about Christ? So I believe that um, He's here with me and you right now. Uh huh. And He lives within. Okay. But what did He do? What did he do to even matter? Well, I, I know that he offered his whole life on a sacrifice, a sacrifice for religious acts, and, and, and devoted his life for us. Right. And that we remember the cross, the prefix of the crucifix, that we worship him. Right. Because he honored all in um, the marriage feast. Because yeah. I don't want to say he crucified, he was crucified, buried, and died. I didn't want to say that. And he, then risen on the third day. Well, that's what 1 Corinthians 15 says. Yeah. You better make that confession. Yeah. It's very... I don't want to put it like in those words. Well, that, so they're... easily like to say it like that. So easily. Well, the, they're the words of Scripture. You should quote yeah. Scripture. Yeah. Please don't... That's the devil trying to steal your... Uh, <clears throat> the seed of the Word out of you. You must make the confession that Christ came in the flesh, Second John... Anyone who denies that Jesus came in the flesh is an antichrist and a deceiver. <clears throat> That's number one. He came in the flesh. Uh, so he did that. So then he 
He endures the scorning and the scoffing and the mocking. He got scourged. He got his flesh torn out of him. He had to carry his own. He had to carry his own cross up the up 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 the hill to the skull of Golgotha, and he died. He died. He buried and was risen on the third day. You and to be to be and then he went to be with the Father. You have to make that confession in order to say you believe the gospel. Can you say that? I, I yeah I I do make that confession. Okay. And, but there's been a lot of. Uh, Well, look, a, a lot of people have done pissy things in the name of Christianity. So just understand, don't don't let churches or don't let nobody discourage you from uh, continuing to pursue the truth, okay? All right, blessings. Thank you for the conversation.